What's good, YouTube? This is Nike coming back with another video, man. Hey, man, this car right here is the best car in the game. Terry Dishinger. He does it all, bro. But he come in standing at what six foot seven, one hundred eighty-five, eighty-nine pounds. Probably has the longest wingspan in the game for a shooting guard. Besides T Mac, him and T Mac pretty much had the same shooting guard build. Um. But with, with this car, he has everything. A 95 three ball, 95 dunk, 85 standing dunk, 94 ball handling, 92 pass actually. And in defense, he has 98 steal, 92 block, 95 perimeter. And everything with the metrics, physical metrics, just stands out 95 plus all over the board. Badge wise, he has, I think 33 halves, every half in the game, pretty much all the best, best halves, like limits takeoff, posterizer. Agent 3's blinders, limitless, dead eye, everything, clamp breaker, clamps, quick first step. He has every single badge in the game that's pretty much all the better badges in the game. With also, how many uh, gold badges? 31 gold badges, and you, you can add whatever house you want to or whatnot, bro. He's a beast, bro. He has every badge in the game, honestly, bro. Every single badge in the game. But let me get to uh, shooting, bro. Shoot him. Show y'all what his his sigs and animations look like, man. So this card is better than T Mac. I'm letting y'all boys know this right now, man. He can dribble. He has Steve Francis, Steve Francis size up, John Wall size up escape. So you can like. Now he has Curry size up escape. Yeah, he got. Excuse me. He got Curry size up escape. So you know, I can Curry. I can Curry to Steve Francis. You can Steve Francis bam. He got Oster slide. Um, this is the little Oster right here into the curry, to the snatch. Steve Francis, and this is shot, bro. This is this what separates him. His shot. He has the fastest uppers in the game. It's harder to shoot with than T Mac, but once you get the time of him, man, I'm telling you, bro, he's the best card in the game. Uh, let's look by, at behind the back. I know y'all love behind the back. He has a decent behind the back. And then. Let's look at dunks. He got what? Front clutches. So he got all the best dunks in the game, pretty much. Besides like quick drops, but if he got front clutches, that that's pretty much like quick drops. But yeah, and then also fades. What fade he has? I think he has normal. Yep, normal fade. So <clears throat> you know that's chick, man. He has the best shot in the game with the best sticks, bro. He's pretty much a mob player, but I'm letting y'all boys know this right now. Um, let's get to the gameplay, man. Okay, y'all, here comes the gameplay with Terry. I wanted to really showcase why Terry was the best shooting guard, so I was going to show a lot of clips of me shooting. And this is why I wanted to show you. He comes off the screen, first possession, pow, in between two people. Then, second possession, he gets a steal right away and drops it off the per purpose for the easy two-hand quick drop, man. This showing he could do everything, bro. Then next possession, dude was in the zone, so I couldn't really, like, get a lot of shots off, and he was, like, really, like, hugging my three. But you see how, how quick it gets up. Real quick, I promise you, bro. Then Terry comes back down, you know, not watching that one time. Man, he not watching it again. I'm telling you, he shows he can does it. He can do it all on the defensive side of the ball and the offensive side of the ball. Then I come off the screen, crab T Mac, easy three, bang, bro. Then he comes again. Uh, where you going, T Mac? Uh, separate yourself, Terry. Pow. Terry got the best dribble moves in the game. He's really like a mob player. T-Mac almost got the steal, came off of it, one dribble pull up, bang. Terry's shot, shot is really weird with the hands, but it gets up quick. So you, when you use this card, you have to get used to it. Oh, look at this. That is a peak if you ain't see one. I shot in between two people, bang. He has the fastest shot in the game, pretty much. It's hard to get up, like learn how to release, but once you get the like timing of it, it's really good, I promise you. But like I said, we off on a break with Terry. <laughs> One dribble, pull up, right in his mid, pow, hit the 12%. And that's the difference between Terry and other, any other shooting guard. Like, what you're seeing right now, I'm literally shooting. I'm pretty much quick stopping every shot. And everything is, like, literally under 12 to 15%. So, what y'all got to realize is, hey, with the bounce slot, look at Terry showcasing himself. Oh, getting back on defense. Hey, walk back, walk back, walk back. One dribble, hmm, bang. And that's the front clutches. But what I was getting to is, like, you got to realize that once you realize how to quick stop and whatnot, I think that's when Terry is unguardable because everything is might should be under 15%. So once you get the time of it, you can literally make this car un unguardable. And look, 
41 to 16 with Terry. Like I got him out of here quick first game. Second game. First play with Terry. Bang. Walk back off the screen. And this is what I'm saying. You need to showcase that Terry like is the best card in that game. He's really like a mop player. Came off the screen, laid me. Just easy, easy work. He wanna all on me, walk back, <laughs> Steve Francis, fade me. And that's that's the difference between him and T Mac. He can create his shot shot way better because he actually has dribble moves just like a my player so that was that was a real quick game he wasn't dealing with that the the terry show third game <clears throat> walk back and i paused cheese them man like he needed to know that terry is on the court so i had to serve my dominance on you feel me uh, another angle phase step back pow not a lot of people doing that with terry and terry is like the best card in the game i'm telling you you see how he's just dribbling he moves different it's a difference between him and T-Mac because he moves a lot different with the and one with Terry. Terry come off the screen. Oh, you're not going to step. <laughs> you're going to learn to. I promise you that. Next position, Terry got badged. Now, you know what time it is. Uh, misdirection into the Steve Francis half course quick stop. Bang. Off the glass. And this is what I'm saying. Uh, yep, snatch. What I do? Angle fade? <laughs> come on, bro. You better play some D, bro. You can't, you can't not just... Let your AI or like play fake defense on this car. You see what I'm saying? Like everything is open. I'm literally quick stopping everything. Mm, Steve Francis. Oh, Steve Francis Curry spam into the quick stop bay. This is why I'm telling you this car is literally the best car in the game. Snatch. Double Steve Francis quick stop right in between the oh my god. Terry's literally the best, bro. You see, I'm literally just picking his lids off now, bro. He can't get a stop, bro. This is what I'm saying. Terry is the best card. T-Mac is not doing none of these moves. He can do like one or drill, two dribble moves. Max. Terry, you can have a whole different bag. Like, you see this, bro? He has a whole different bag for scoring, bro. Like, literally. A whole different bag of scoring. And, bro, got him out of here quick, man. Got him out of here quick. This right here is to show y'all, man. Terry Dishinger is by far the number one shooting guard. The number one player on this game. He is the best card on the game. He clears any other car. No other car really can compete with him due to the fact that he can dunk the ball, stand and dunk, quick stop, and the main thing, he can dribble. He has my player six with a my player jump shot. All you got to really do is get used to his, his hands on his shot, and when you figure that out, I promise you, you're golden. Again, this is the best card again. I'm 100% telling you to lock this set in. If you got the MT, man, if you got the MT, Please, please lock this set in. He's the best card on the game. Hey, man, I appreciate y'all tuning into the video. Don't forget to leave a like, comment, and subscribe, man. And I'm out. Peace.